Hey, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? So I have no idea where this came from, but somebody sent me a Bible. Okay, so we're gonna talk about it. This is it. This is the Cultural Background Study Bible. Uh, Keener wrote the, for the Old Te for the New Testament. I forget the guy that did the New Testament without looking at it in a minute. Um, it's got, let's see here, 375 full color photos, illustrations, and images. We got some charts in there. We got the words of Jesus in red, cross references, indexes, uh, 300 articles. Um, doesn't say how many footnotes there are, probably over 5,000, I would guess. Made in China. God made the heavens and the earth and everything in it is made in China. Um, and that's kind of it. I find it I find it odd that Bibles are printed in China, but if you have a Bible in China, you go to jail. Just seems odd to me. But anyways, so there's that. Um, there's the Bible. Uh, there's the spine. Let's see if it'll zoom in. It should. Let me see here. Nope, it won't. Okay, but there it is. So um, it's got New International, it's got the NIV logo, Zanderdorf, and NIV Cultural Background Study Bible. The, the outside of it is fake. This is not real leather. For 80 bucks, you get what you get. Okay. Kind of, you know, and it's got it's got all your standard stuff. It's got your quick starts that, and, yeah. I mean that. I mean it does have some some explanation on Hebrew and Greek, which is always nice to have, because you know most people aren't Greek scholars. Okay, um, it's got graphs for the Old Testament. Um, some of them are in color, some of them aren't. Um, let me go ahead and go over to the New Testament. Um, Let's just go to Acts chapter 8. I like Acts 8. Okay. It's one of my favorite chapters in the whole Bible. I mean, you just, I, every time I read to Acts 8, I just get excited. So we have an article on magic in the New Testament. We have footnotes all over the place. And honestly, these are written from most, by a Pentecostal. I, I don't know if I would consider him a classical Pentecostal. Um, but he definitely, I mean, he went to CBC, the same place I went. So, um, great guy, graduated from AGTS as well. Uh, he wrote the, the footnotes for the New Testament. One of the things I like is this, is it has the, all the archaeology to understand the, you know, the different things. That's really cool, full collar. Um, just overall it's a really nice bible uh, and like i said i have no idea where it came from now is it this bad boy no this is probably the best bible you can get okay this is the niv study bible i also like the comparing them i like the the two-tone I like the leather on this, the brown leather, a lot better than I like this black. Um, so uh, this is this is superior. I would say this Bible, if you go to if you got a hundred bucks to spend on a Bible, this is the way to go. Okay, this thing is just amazing. I love this Bible. Best Bible I've ever had. Now, this Bible is a great Bible. If you're wanting to know more about culture and customs and kind of what was going on when the Bible was written, this is the way to go. If you're more theological, this is the way to go. I'm obviously more theological than I am cultural. So that it, it doesn't, I, I'm not saying one is bad. I'm just saying for me, that's where things are. I, like I said, I still don't know where this Bible came from. I don't know who sent it. I don't know who. Somebody did. Somebody and somebody that knows where I live. So it has to be someone close to me 
to to be to do it. Um, but anyways, I guess I'll leave it there. Uh, do I recommend the cultural background study Bible? Absolutely. Is it worth eighty bucks? I don't know. Fifty? Yeah. Eighty? I don't know. Because once you get up in there, you're getting up in the, where you can get this bad boy. I think this bad boy is probably, I'm wanting to say 80 to 90. I would kick this over this any day. But that's just me, and that's because I think more theological. Anyways, I'll leave it there, and thank you for watching. Um, let me know what, have you read, Have do you use this Bible? And if you do, let me know. Anyways, I'll talk to you later. Bye.